in terms of that constitutional question, that broader constitutional question and where the election might take us, um, it's perhaps better to say uh, a, a couple of things first. Okay? Firstly, there's a sort of lazy assumption that Brexit was created a, a one-way street towards the United Ireland. That was always mythical, the idea that Eunice would wake up one morning um, and think, well, actually, now, because of, of Brexit, and a substantial proportion of Eunice voted Remain, about 40% of Eunice's worth were remain, voted Remain. There was far less unanim unanimity amongst, national, uh, amongst Eunice than there was amongst nationalists. 85% of nationalists voted Remain, but uh, only 40% of Eunice voted Remain. But Eunice were never going to become nationalists. What you've seen is a slump in support for the Union. If you look at the, the percentage of people who want Northern Ireland to remain in the United Kingdom, if you look at the, the polar polls there in front of you, it's only at 50% in 2021. It's a far from overwhelming or convincing level of support for the continuation of Northern Ireland's place in the United Kingdom. But that's not to say that there's been a huge drive in support for a United Ireland.